If you're new, hey, what's up? My name is Maribel and I'm a personal trainer. Today, I have a workout for a person who's trying to lose weight. Let's get right into this workout. So if you are a beginner, I don't want you to add any dumbbells, although they do burn extra fat. But if you are a beginner and you're trying to shred fat, I am going to guide you through this workout. So no dumbbells for now. We're going to do side steps with a little bit of endurance. I want you to make sure that you still are engaging your core. Somebody who's advanced could for sure add speed and explosiveness to this move. Another person who is trying to target on their glutes could for sure add a booty band. But for today's purposes, it's a shred fat workout so we just want to move our body and wake our body up so the side by side shuffle you're gonna stay here for a whole minute without no rest you're just gonna keep moving through the entire minute this is gonna wake up your body it's a simple movement and you could also challenge yourself or reduce the impact of the move Whenever you feel tired and the minute's not up, don't stop. Just reduce the explosiveness and do steps. Next move is lunges. So when it comes to lunges, I have a lot of people who have issues with lunges. Honestly, I want your knees to always be bent 90 degrees, shoulders back, chest forward, as well as your head. And I just want you to bend the back knee down and come up. One thing that I don't want you to cheat is to go all the way down where you rest. So if you do this, you're resting. And because it's a workout to shred fat, I'm trying to have your heart rate up, but I'm also trying to consume your energy because we just started the workout and I don't want you to feel fatigued and you just started it. For the lunges, you want to do 30 on each leg and then you could just switch to the opposite. Some people I notice with me training that they need to look down and they need to stare at, at a specific area. That is totally fine as long as your leg are in perfect form. You could look down as long as you're staring at a specific point but eventually i do want your chest back and your gaze forward now we're gonna move to jumping jacks so for those who want to lose fat around their chest i would highly advise frontal jacks for a person who is not for beginners and they just can't move at that speed don't worry, all you really have to do is get new steps, and I would definitely take that. I'm gonna elevate my squat, my lunge. You can see the weight. So I'm basically gonna have my right leg on the weight, and then my opposite leg back. I'm gonna bend 90 degrees, come up, and kick. So I'm going down, come up, and kick. With this move, you're working on stability, your hips, and a little bit of glue, which is what I'm always asked about. I just want you to move side to side, engage your core, bend your knees, and don't overdo your neck, for example. Don't overlook. You don't have to do that. All of your force is coming from your abs. So now I want you to do narrow squat, and I want you to elevate your narrow squat because I want you to have a lower or deeper depth so the ball of your feet are on the weight and you're gonna go all the way down as long as you can and then come back up focusing on your core your gaze are straight forward your shoulders are relaxed your arms can be forward you can 
happen. There's so many different ways of having your arms and waist extended. You have dumbbells in front of you, barbell in back of you. Now we're moving to low lunge because this is a beginner workout. I'm holding on to the rack. Feel free to hold on to anything. I still want your legs 90 degrees. I still want your core tight. And I also want you to do each movement with confidence. You should be so proud that you are showing up for yourself. I really love working out because it gives me a clear mind, honestly. And I'm super proud of you guys. If you have any questions, especially if you're starting your fitness journey, don't hesitate to comment down below any questions or feel free to send me a DM. You guys know I am constantly responding to you guys and trying to help you as much as I can. As you can tell here, I'm doing good mornings and you are working for 60 seconds. You have no rest. If you notice, I'm giving a variation of exercises ones that are gonna have your heart rate up and others that are gonna help you recuperate so now we're gonna do some squats obviously if you are a beginner i want you to just use your body weight and i want you to squat as if you're cheating as if you're cheating as if you're sitting on a chair all the way down somebody who's working on growing their glutes could for sure add some waist to their squat and i'll show you guys in a minute but somebody who really wants to try the rack and wants to do a squat i'm gonna invite you to move all the weight and do a barbell squat so you can get the form down pack looking straight your barbell is exactly where it's supposed to be in your upper back and then you're gonna go as low as you can and then come back up if you have any Mobility issues when it comes to your hips or bad knees. Grab a weight, put it on the floor, and try to elevate your squat. That's going to reduce a little bit more. You're just going to be able to go have more depth. Okay. So you are giving yourself the experience of a squat rack, but you are working toward adding weight. We're gonna move to jumping jack and this is your last move of your workout so give it your all you are still working for a whole entire minute as i mentioned every move that i did is working for a minute and unless i told you otherwise for example the lunges i wanted 30 reps so i'm not going to tell you how low to go everybody's depth is different just give me explosiveness you could use your arm as momentum but you don't need your arm Hey guys, so this is your workout. I'm trying to hide the sun. I'm trying to figure out the lighting and all of that, but I hope you enjoyed this video. This is for beginners, and I did throw a little bit of tips for advanced, so you won't get bored. You can always advance any move. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to comment down below or DM me. That's totally fine, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.